So today I ran across a bi-directional oil pump. It's pretty cool. It's kind of interesting here. The oil comes in this port, comes out this port. Doesn't matter which way we rotate. And if you notice, there's a little keyway down there and we are offset in the board. There's a little ring that's offset. So if we pull the washer out here, okay. Now, first we'll get to the bottom first. Let's take a look at the whole thing. So the oil comes in at the bottom and comes out. See that ring through at the middle? That is the discharge port through there. You'll just have to trust me. It comes out the middle of that ring. Up my here. There, you can barely see it back in there. So the oil comes in at the bottom, right there, and then comes goes out into this ring. This is the rotor that sits in the bottom. And you can see how it's been rubbing the housing. It just sits in there. And you'll notice we have a little offset. It's tight on that side, gap on that. And it doesn't matter which way this spins, it's keyed to a shaft. So the other part that fits is this little guy. Kind of hard to film, but no matter which way you rotate it, the valve changes position. So he rotates one way and he lines one of those ports from that side to that ring. So this is essentially, this little washer acts like a valve. Turn it one way, that, that hole opens up. Turn it the other way, that hole opens up. So it doesn't matter which way we, we uh, turn this thing, we get positive flow. So, P goes in the bottom. Okay. So you can see how that just flips one way or the other. Pretty slick little setup. Little snap ring. Done little deal. That's for this little gearbox here. And it sits down here on the bottom. Pulls oil in from the bottom. There's our little keyed shaft. Pumps oil out the top. 